Hey gamers, it's Grind This Game here, back with Oxygen Not Included, the uh, extra hard mode playthrough. And in this episode, we're going to try to get some of the space research stuff done. The little databanks that we've been collecting up at the top of the map. These little things here, where are they? These things, databanks. We're going to try to research those so that we can finish off the rocket research here. So we can get some of these other things like the petroleum engine and liquid fuel tank and solid oxidizer tank. So that'll be one of the goals of this episode. Um, last episode we had a bit of a bug here. Since I reloaded the game, that's been fixed. The fa infinite falling sand or regolith has been fixed. Uh, right now we're just filling the rocket back up. How much do we got here? Yeah, filling the rocket back up so that we can keep getting more data banks. And I think we've researched pretty much every asteroid, I think. Oh, we're on. We're almost done this one, and that'll be the last one, I think. I did add some automation here. So if the pressure falls below 19,000 grams of steam in this room, I go and grab some more uh, steam from this room, which is was a happy accident that the gold volcano happened to be in this room. Now, by accident, I pumped way too much water in here. I thought I had set the thing to 100 grams per second, but it was actually set to 10 kilograms per second, and it got overflown. Overflowed. It overflowed. Uh, so we got lots of steam in here, and eventually, over time, this gold will turn all the rest back to steam, so it's probably not the end of the world. Some of you have suggested I should, should deconstruct these windows to get some steel. Not a bad idea. What about the statue? It's granite. So we could get some steel that way, but I'm just going to leave this area intact because it's kind of nice looking. I was considering trying out building my rocket area down here instead of way up here. And I also noticed that you can build rockets kind of without a base anymore. That's, I think that might be new. I'm not 100% sure, but let's go super speed here. I was going to dig across here just to see what else we got. I should probably put that at a higher priority. I did sort of reset my priorities a little bit uh, in this area. I kind of did a big f a full reset and then I just notched up researching and I thought I had notched up cooking, but oh yeah, I have here for Abe, but we have two cooks. I should probably notch them both up and I won't stop anyone, any other dupes from cooking, but I think the priority should be enough to get it done. We got another shovel leg there. I did get some suggestions. Oh, I had a bit of hydrogen overflow here. I wasn't really watching this anymore, and we didn't really have storage hooked up. I've just been building up the uh, hydrogen here. And the neighbor's dog always likes to bark when I start recording. Hmm. Anyway, we got lots of spare hydrogen for liquid hydrogen if we ever do it. I don't know if I will, though. So yeah, I got some comments about the base saying, instead of trying to go do all the space stuff, why not just try to build a mega base and expand out? And I'm, I'm actually considering that now. Which, why, did I, why did I put these blocks in here? Oh, it was too big. Okay. Fair enough. I think I'm going to extend over this way into this hot area, because the base is getting nice and chilly. And some of you have said, have said like, why did I set my aqua tuner steam turbine set up so cold? And it was intentional. I actually wanted to get the base super cold, because I wanted to expand out into these hot areas. And now I can do it without too much risk of uh, disaster. So we're going to actually just crank this, crack this right open. And I think I'll extend out... How, sharp, how, how far should we go here? Um, let's see. How big is this room? 64 tiles. It is 16 wide. We could go 16 wide here too. Right to there. And maybe even 16 more wide? 
That's a possibility. What just happened? Scalding. Uh oh, where did they go? Where have they gone? Who got injured? Oh, I might have just let them out here. Oh no. Oh, I made a loop. That's not good. Okay. Hmm. We don't want them going down here. I gotta block this off right away. And can they get, get at the top? No, they can't get at the top. So, we'll get that sealed in. Because I don't want the dupes running around without their suits on. Otherwise, they will get burnt. And it is pretty hot in here, so we'll have to be careful on the way out here. Oh, we got a suit on right here. Okay, what temperature? 64, 74. We'll have to be careful as we go out here. Maybe for just now, we'll extend it. Let's rebuild these floors. This doesn't really need to be insulated. Okay, let's build this out. Replace this with granite. You know what? We could use gold. We could use some gold. Not lead. Gold. Yeah. Gold metal tile. They will really like that if I do that. It'll be potentially really warm, but we're cooling the base, so it's okay. So if this is 16 wide... Make sure I did that right. 16, yeah. And I don't think I'll do another ladder in here. Let's just actually build that right across. Like that. Oh, with gold. Delicious gold. And I think I'll crack this open as well. So we'll extend this great hall. Extend the bedroom. Get some more dupes in here. And instead of granite, let's use gold. Something like that. This all deconstructed. Yeah, hell, what's the temperature of this gold? Oh, it's fine. It's, it's almost frozen right away. And I've just trapped a dupe here. So let's get them fixed up. I think they could actually come down like this. Yeah, there we go. Okay, all good. Emergency over. this across. Okay, so as we cool down this area here, uh, we can extend out even more. 64. Let's just try to do this. Trapped another dupe. You shouldn't be trapped. What are you doing there? The save leg is horrendous at this stage of the game. Danny, are you trapped? Yes, you are. Okay. We will get you out of there, Pronto. Let's do this instead. There we go. Danny has been rescued. I should probably go check on my rocket here. How are we doing? It's wasting steam. Okay. Let's turn that automation off. And make sure the steam is being cleared. It is. So let's launch that sucker. Launch. And we're just going to this thing over and over again. Getting more data banks. I got the recommendation that the steam rocket could have something like 9 or 13 of those um, research modules, but I'm just going to keep the rocket as is for now. 
I did put another door up here because I didn't want all the regolith coming in, so I had to extend my automation of power up this way. So that's that. Did I extend the power? Yep. So that should keep the tunnel um, potentially more clear, maybe, maybe not. Okay, back home we go here. My puffed wrench didn't really work out very well. I think they're crowded at the moment. I hate wrenching puffs. It's really a, really pain in, a, real, a big pain in the butt for me. I know there's probably a better way to do it, but they definitely need a little bit more room, that's for sure. I'm going to start bringing the polluted dirt down automatically, I think, instead of getting the dupes to deliver it. And we could also bring the slime up to the dupes into the farm right here. This is oh, bleach stone and should be slime as well. Yep. Yeah, we could automatically bring it up here and just plop it in here. And same thing with like this polluted dirt here. But before we do all that, let's stick to one project at a time. I'm gonna get this little bit done, get their bedrooms back. We got, we got people sleeping on the floor. That's never good. I think we can do even more gold up here. Just to make it all nice and sexy in here. The decor is going to be off the charts. Oh yeah, look at that. And we could probably cram more dupes in here and get rid of some of these statues. Now that we have gold tiles. So we'll go we'll go max squishage for the dupes. Now I'm not gonna use plastic beds because they they're not really necessary. Two, four, six, eight. Who do we appreciate? Dupes. Oops. Yay. Okay. Paintings. We're gonna go kind of boring. Boring old school. There we go. Look at that. Okay, so auto sweeper. Well, we'll get the best all done first. Let's get some more gold in here. Gold, gold, gold. are we doing in here for oh we lost a bit of decor but once all those paintings are in there it'll be better statues can go gonna do these as party nine you know what we could use the tall paintings here slow things down a bit <laughs> uh, let's do portrait canvas yeah I think I might move my water cooler over a bit. Right over one. How's the temperature? 43. Okay, we should rough out the next segment here. And I think we can afford to take on another dupe here. Uh, food is running pretty dangerously low. What do we got? Noodle arms, noodle arms, narcoleptic. I don't like any of these dupes. We'll wait for the next round. And I'm going to reset these priorities here to seven. Uh, let's get the water cooler back in there first, though. Hmm, where can we put the water cooler? It's, we can't really make it symmetrical as is without messing up the painting alignment. So we'll just stick it here. Take that priority nine. 
get that room done. And then one of the paintings has to be variety nine. And we can put these in. Okay. So we want to get the telescope going. Where should we stick that? I might put it... Or not the telescope, but the... Uh, what did I have in here? I don't even remember having... I, did I have extra pip, pips in here? I think that was the idea. They are very cramped. Um... Could stick it down here. Yeah, let's do the, that. So the the virtual planetarium gives off a bit of heat, but we're we're pretty well cooled, so I think we'll stick that there. Get that powered up. What's the power usage here like? Not too bad. Then we can get researching those data banks. And we definitely need more slime. Oh no, we got 13 kilograms. Oh, that's not very much. We need more slime. Okay. I was going to upgrade this ladder, but they're taking their sweet time. Insufficient oxygen generation. That's an issue. Let's go find that slime. Where do we want to go? There's one down here. There's one up here that we've kind of already gotten into. So yeah, let's go in here. And start... Digging that down, I guess. We'll do a ladder. Maybe like this. One, two, three, four, and then maybe like that. I don't want to kind of puncture the floor here. But we could replace it with granite. Like this. And then, uh, work our way in there. I did run out of water at one point when I was doing some stuff off camera. And that's because I was. I hadn't really tied into this one yet. Let's do this as a nine, because we're going to run out of. I'm here soon. Try to consolidate all the polluted water at the bottom, I guess. dig through here safely without getting stuck. Okay, we'll let them do that. As an 8, I guess. And let's get back to our planetarium thing, which has the unreachable dig. Hmm. Not exactly true. Unless they're considering this unreachable. Nope, they're making it. Okay, there we go. Let's do some research. We want uh, hydrocarbon combustion. Oops, I think I just turned it off, not on. We'll make this a uh, eight. And let's watch someone go in here because this thing's pretty awesome when they get in here. Let's make it a nine. Soon we'll be done all the research. deconstruct some of the research buildings, I think. Okay. 
Data banks delivered. Get in there, someone. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Snappy's on the ball. Oh, no oxygen down there. That was an oversight. <laughs> okay, that was the worst place to put it. Now, now that I think about it. Hmm. Stuff getting done, though. 19. Okay, that was not very smart of me. Uh, and we're going to make a little oxygen room here, maybe. Just so they can breathe. We're going to get rid of this tree, I guess. Back this back to a six until we have a little bit of oxygen down here. Or I could just move it. I could have put it up here, I guess. We're not really using this at the moment. Do we have power up there? We do. I'm gonna move it. Okay, we'll save the tree. Save the tree. Now, hopefully, our databanks don't get used up. If we destroy the building, no, good. That would be a bad bug. And I would cry and reload from a save. Station. Virtual planetarium. We're going to stick this in the future ranch. And that way our researcher can breathe, at least. How's this temperature in here? Uh, not too bad. Not too bad. Let's let's do the next room. Gold. Oh, I used a lot of the gold up. Quite a bit. Hmm. It's going fast. But it's worth it, I think. Actually, we don't want it here yet. Let's just use granite for now. We want this to be another 16 wide, which goes to there. So our door would technically go here. Or our insulating wall. I think I'll do an insulating wall right here. Make sure that's 16 again. 16. Scalding. So this will be the new envelope. And we do want to insulate it because it's freaking hot over there. We're going to go find that burning dupe. The minute that happens again. Because we can go find who's injured. Uh, health. Who is burning? Snappy. You're burning in there? 63 degrees? She's taking damage in there. What the heck? Okay. Hmm. That thing is cooling down. Why is it giving up so much heat? Crazy. Oh, the databanks are at 169 degrees. Oh my gosh. I wonder if that's the issue. Okay, it's not so hot in there anymore. Not too bad, okay. Onwards and upwards. So we'll do another floor here. Like that. And we'll fix this bedroom. This is a bit of a... I kind of liked it, but let's fix it up. What the heck, Snappy? What the heck? Hmm. 
fucking dying in there. <laughs> what is going on here? 4,500 DTU. That is a lot. This is like a torture chamber. Oh my gosh. Goodbye. Snappy, go recover. We're gonna stick that thing in a cold area instead. I'm gonna stick it in this ranch. Temporarily. There's another cold area we could stick it in. We could, uh... We could stick it... Here, maybe? That's some loud industry going on there. Can we stick it here? We could stick it here. It's cooled here. It's cold here. Yeah, let's do it there. Let's go check on our... Oops, go check on our rocket. It's back already? Or did it ever launch? It never launched. Okay. It did launch. We're just gonna fill it up. Sometimes I play this game after a long day of work and my brain is fried. And in some ways it's relaxing, and in some ways you get probably frustrated with me because I'm making terrible decisions. Okay, let's go get some more slime. Let's poke a hole through here. Get all that delicious slime out of there. That'll be good. Do the same thing over here. And I don't like seeing all this nasty air. So we're gonna deodorize this. Might as well get up in here, too. And I think we got a neural vacillator recharge somewhere. Uh, I saw one earlier, but maybe it's gone. That's weird. Maybe it's not accessible right now. Okay, we can start upgrading this here. And it shouldn't spill out. We got a lot of natural gas stored up, a lot of oil storing up. Oh, and I, I made a bunch of oil storage right here. Which is all full now. Wow. We're not using our oil fast enough. Quite blocked. We're not using our petroleum at all. Generator generator idle. Hmm. But we're out of lime anyway, so we're not really using up the petroleum. Hmm. And I'm not using ethanol at all anymore, so we could take this away. Yeah, let's get rid of that pipe. Clean up a bit of the spaghetti. And they haven't research or built this yet. Let's make that a nine. Oh, one thing I did off-camera was add a little tube axis here so they could get back quicker. That's been working pretty well. Let's notch this up here. What temperature do we got? Good. Okay. Snappy, you better not fry yourself again. Well, you're in a suit anyway. You should be fine. I think we need to get Snappy uh, cured, though. Uh, let's get Snappy in the medical bed for some care and attention. Um, let's check for dupes here. 
No taste. Yokel, that's fine. Decreased science, decreased calories. Okay, let's go for Lindsay. Now I want to start automating some stuff, so we're going to bring this polluted dirt down. Let's do an auto sweeper. Out of iron. Aluminum should be fine. We want to pick up all that nasty crap. And I might actually extend this room over a bit. So let's put it right there. And we're going to jam that into a conveyor loader. Aluminum should be fine. Stick that right there. And I actually want to run this through the wall. But I need to extend my wall out to the next section here. Actually, I'm not... Yeah, we are going to put a wall here. So let's get that out of the way. But I gotta make sure they don't come out of here with dirty hands. Actually, it doesn't. It's all sealed up. It's okay. Take this out. We'll get a granite floor going on here. Over to there. And we'll build a wall here. And then we're going to extend that conveyor load, conveyor belt all the way down here. I guess I'm going to have to dig all this out. Just make sure they don't burn here. Okay, we're going to pick up organic, polluted dirt, priority 7, sure. Auto sweeper, get some power in there. Okay, now we've got that wall there. I think we can just open this up here and let the dupes in suits dig this out for us. And just to get this prepared here, there'll be a door. And let's go four down. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. These will all become some sort of room at some point. One, two, three, four. Hopefully I've done that all right. Let's check our sizing here. That'll be 16. That's good. Okay, let's start to dig all that out. Okay, put some doors in. Yeah, I don't know what I'm going to put in these rooms yet, but we'll figure it out. And then our conveyor load, or conveyor line can go conveyor rail. What should we make out of copper spine? That'll go through the wall. I kind of like to put it through the wall. And we'll take it all the way down and we're going to send it into the puffed room and just dump it. So we'll do like a conveyor chute. Once we unfreeze from lagging, conveyor shoot here. And we'll just dump that on the ground. And then we can stop uh, manually bringing it over. And I'm bringing p polluted dirt in because I want them to, it'll just give off polluted oxygen for these little guys. Yeah, what are we doing here? They're building. Guess we 
we have to do this piece here. Okay, that'll that'll leave for a pretty massive massive base if we get all this roughed out. Go all the way down here. And then eventually we'll clear out this section here. How's our food doing? I forgot to plant the rest. Temperature in here is oh, getting a little bit warm. I think we're okay for now. We don't have a great haul yet. We gotta get this art done. Let's turn the water cooler off. Oh, it's delivering food polluted dirt. Zero, zero, zero. Why does it pick up such tiny amounts and then I think it's gassing off? So bizarre. It's not actually going anywhere. Why are there a million piles of polluted dirt here that are zero? This is very strange. I guess it's gassing off like a tiny, tiny amount. And then it's, uh... <laughs> yeah, we need to get it sent somewhere here. I think I just set the priority wrong there. Nine. Unreachable dig. Of course. Okay, we got our barracks, we got our great hall, great hall, good. How's our research going? Is it uh, moving along? It is, we're getting our way. We got through this piece, now we're getting through this piece. Good. We can extend the bathroom here once we get this all set up. safely go in here to a point. I should probably dig from the top down. This could be scorching over here. Let's let's wait for that. Actually we just gotta do it. I think. Now by, by halving, having the mass here, when you dig it, the mass gets cut in half. You could actually pick up all this crap and store it just outside here. Behind the insulated area. That's an idea. Yeah, we could do that. We'd actually want to get it back at some point though, maybe? Dirt, sand. Not super important stuff. It's too hot here though. 74 degrees. Maybe we'll just seal it in for now. And all this hot material will move somewhere else. I don't know where. This thing is going mad here. I guess it doesn't really matter. It is wasting energy. Finish this off here. Let's do that. We're gonna finish this off. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. No, it's not. <laughs> it's not lined up. We'll have to raise the floor or something. 
bringing this down here. We're gonna stick that through the wall. And we'll have to dig a tunnel through here. In there. Okay, let's dig through here. And I can make this buffed room a little bit larger. What do we got right now? It's uh, 80 something. 86. We can make it 10 bigger. Hopefully, I can build this before the. The guys fly out of here. I don't think they'll leave though, because there's nothing for them to eat outside of here. This meat that's been in there forever. Okay, come and build this, please. We might lose our puffs here. Okay, we'll just hope they get it done. We're losing all our polluted oxygen here. Ah. Uh, Yeah, I consider this a slight emergency. Okay. I could have built it from the bottom. Ah. <laughs> what a mess. That's all cleared up, and we got our thing going in. I probably should have raised the roof slightly. Let's do this. We're gonna do this. Then we'll deconstruct that. That's uh, eight, nine. That might work out nicely. We'll get it to full size in a second here. And we'll get rid of this container here. Don't need it anymore. We're at 92, 93, 94. Oh, we'll be close. 95. And then we don't need this here anymore. 96. We're, we're good. Full size. Beautiful. And let's finish off the conveyor loader, conveyor rail. Keeping an eye on food, make sure people don't starve to death. I really gotta get off the mushrooms at some point. What do we have going on here? Damage overloading. Uh, potential power consumed 1.38. Oh, I got a bad wire there. Look at that. Look at that. I missed it. Any others like that? Probably. I kind of want to see this project done. So we're going to make this a 9. Put a floor in here. Probably should put airflow tiles in here at some point. We'll upgrade it later. Make sure they don't fry. 70 degrees. Hmm. Careful. 
careful. For the top of the base, we should probably insulate off up here. What should we put in here? This could be more bedrooms. This would be low priority. My unimaginative bedrooms. Okay, how, how hot is this? 73. I think we can go in here. I didn't mess any of these up. Four, 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 four. That no, looks good. I guess the bottom is going to be here. So maybe this is. I probably went too far here. And unreachable. Let's, we got to get that fixed. Let me check my rocket. It's probably. I've been probably venting steam here forever here. Oh, that's not good. Tuned. I think we can launch it. Yeah, good to go. How much steam do we have left in here? 17 kilograms and lots of tiles. Gold volcano. Next dormancy five. We're gonna lose our heat source in a bit. That's okay. It's nice and toasty in here. Well, actually, it's kind of, it's kind of got a little bit cooler in here. Okay, food is quite low again. Do we have slime? 5.8 tons. Yeah, we're not out of slime. You know what, though? Now that I've removed this, we can grow some more mushrooms in here. Now these ones won't be fertilized. That is a okay. Now we could auto load the slime onto all these, but I'd have to kind of pressurize this whole area. Oh, I forgot about this bedroom. <laughs> uh, we don't need it anymore. We're going to get rid of that bedroom. We'll leave the art though. I'm gonna need to build a bigger farm here, I think. Oops, wrong button. Everything is still growing though, that's good. I don't think we, I think we've been neglecting our hatch farm quite a bit, because this is all empty. I should probably, I'll let them kind of get back to everything. A few cycles here. We could put another, we could put these pit pips over here though. Let's do pip pip squeak auto wrangle at six. And we'll copy that setting right here. Get some pips over here. Oh, there's no trees in there for them. They're gonna go up in there and they're gonna die. Starve to death. It'll be the starving chamber. Will this 
rough out some more floors here. Like I said, I'm not sure what I'm going to do with these floors, but we, we're going to try to pack in a bunch of dupes, I think. I'll rough that out. Okay. And I think we'll do some airflow here. And my hydrogen storage area here is kind of in the way of the base. <laughs> Okay, sorry Mr. Tree, you're in the way, and Mr. Mealwood, our grand plan. Where did that little guy come from? Elderly. Quit messing with my stuff. He transformed into a piece of meat. Amazing. Oh, let's not kill any dupes now. Or we'll be turning into meat. Or primordial ooze. How's that research? 148. Let's make sure they're getting something done over here. Now I turned the plastic off because I've got tons of plastic. We have 45 tons of plastic, so we're probably good on the plastic. And insufficient... Oh, data banks. Go to data banks. That's okay. The rocket's off to get more. I guess we could be doing more rockets. Back to the mission at hand. Is he trapped? No. I guess for now I'll insulate this floor. Or we could, you know what? Hmm. We could do this instead. We could fill this in and push all this hydrogen down and get maybe one more floor in. Oh, they can't get in there. I, I made it so they couldn't get in there. Okay, never mind. Abort, abort, abort the plan. We'll just insulate here. And in the future, we'll expand down into here. That's a lot of priority nine. You know what? There's, it's a bit risky because they might actually not get to anything. We'll do it at a seven. I think we can safely open all these doors. Well, maybe not the... Uh, oh, we gotta be careful about when we open the bathroom up.
Is my polluted dirt actually going anywhere? No. I think I've missed something. Aha! I did. Surprise, surprise. Okay, we're running low on oxygen. N understandable, since we opened up all these cavities. Now there's one thing I didn't describe a few episodes ago, and I put this I put this pump here. And it's pumping hot oxygen into the base. I had all this oxygen outside the base, which wasn't really helping anyone. Hello. What are you doing? It's bug. Where's the falling debris? Oh, jeez. Please, Clay, fix your game. You're out of early access. Things like this are unacceptable. Okay, that's a... Uh, that's getting a bit bigger there. I like how the base kind of... The whole industrial area is basically beside the whole livable area now. So we've got our hatch area. we got our massive stables. we got our food, which is pretty minuscule. 13 dupes plus one in the rocket. So yeah, we're going big here. Big for, big for this difficulty level. Not big for a regular playthrough, but... Guess they can't build here, or they can probably build there. They're just taking their time. Uh oh, this oil is really filling up here. Pipe blocked. Oh yeah, I'm just gonna start burning the petroleum automatically. I think. Let's do that. Let's put this in here. We're gonna remove the automation from this battery. Or from this this area. There we go. We should just start burning petroleum automatically. No, it's not. Oh, it's all blocked because we can't don't have any lime. Okay, let's do some iron then. We'll do 99 iron. There we go. That should get the coolant out of there. And then this light. I need to trigger this light. Okay, so this whole time I didn't really need to leave, remove my automation. I just needed to get this thing going. No power. <laughs> are we out of natural gas? We are. Uh, hmm. Okay, we got the petroleum generator going. That's good. We should have two going in a second here. Um, what's going on here? Ethanol? I think I might have to rebuild this. Because there is petroleum going in, but... I think it might be because of a mixed liquid that this is not working. But I'm out of time here, so we'll let them catch up with a lot of all the building, and we'll, I'll make sure they don't starve, and we'll continue on next time with our great adventure. Thank you all for watching. Um, we will see you all in the next episode. Bye-bye.